Okay guys, today we're just gonna really quickly show you a route from the Cathedral Ward Lantern over to the old Yarnum Lantern. You can see we have just popped into Cathedral Ward. Out left, again, for some reason, the Grave Keepers are not spawning in here. Don't know what's going on there. But we will continue on down this route. All right, we're going to, yeah, we're just gonna nope around the enemies. Take off this way to the left. <clears throat> the only one you really have to worry about is the dog and the dogs that spawn in up here. Right over here, you're gonna have to open that door I just ran through. Operate this device. That will slide the coffin there out for you to run down, watch out for the henchmen, and I completely missed the friggin' steps. Yep, <laughs> now we're gonna run down the steps. They're gonna follow me a lot further than they normally do. You can pick up that Tempering Blood Gemstone. Um, if you haven't picked up one yet, that is a guaranteed Blood Gem, which will get you the uh, Blood Gem trophy. Okay, now we're going to head down this way. Watch out, there is a nether beast here to the left. I don't know if you can see him. Yep, there he is. Big old werewolf. They're pretty easy to deal with. Dodge his first attack and just start swinging. They stun anytime they're hit. So they're pretty easy to deal with. We got some bloodstone shards. And then we're going to head right on down this way. Just, well, used to be able to jump over that pretty easily. All right, down we go. And here is the old Yarnum Lantern. We'll go ahead and light that. And that's pretty much it. That's a pretty straightforward lantern to get. Also, if you come back here, bust these pots up, you can get three pungent blood, co blood cocktails. So until next time, guys, catch y'all later.